glittering and meaning and all week long the football chatter has centered around this game and these talented teams which one will outwit the other in a stadium both packed and passionate so many questions to be answered on a day of destiny stay tuned we'll have all the action for you live from london here on ea tv Delighted to be able to report very agreeable weather for the fans here at the Emirates Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Arsenal up against Crystal Palace. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there is... Is this the moment? Just leaning back a bit and over the bar. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Kai Havertz starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the focal point in attack is Gabriel Jesus. And the cross goes in. Well, mopping up defensively. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. Well, it's a back four, a narrow midfield three, and a very disconnected front three. But if the midfield... Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. And he read it superbly. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, a yellow card so early in this one, Stuart. Well, it doesn't matter how early it is in the game, that's a poor challenge and deserved the booking. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Ben White. And now Havertz. Well, it wouldn't stay in play for them. Goal kick. Really good challenge. Gabriel Jesus prepared to fire. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Good bit of closing down. Jefferson Lerma. Well, great read there to intercept. Martinelli it's a good palace move in the making superb defensive judgment to end the attack incisive pass Are you now with Lerma? Odson Edouard and Palace unable to retain possession. Declan Rice, Gabriel Jesus. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Ezzy and Edouard with it Lerma top class defending he has teammates around him and he takes on the shot oh good work by the keeper Saka Havertz Marcinelli can he finish but into the keeper's gloves effective work from Arsenal to regain possession 
Will he play it in? That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Are you? Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And pull back. And a goal! 1-0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Well, let's have another look at this, because he does really well to pick the right pass here, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So the game restarted by Arsenal. A wake-up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? And Kai Havertz... And he did what he had to do defensively. And we will have just one additional minute. Well, a really good run. And time is up as far as the first half is concerned. So the ball is rolling again. Arsenal trailing going into the second half. Will they come up with the right response? Cutting infield here. Gabriel Jesus. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, good accuracy, and enough power to beat the keeper. That's an excellent goal. Back underway, level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. Will Hughes. Eberechi Ezi on the ball. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Arsenal recovering possession well. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Chance to put them in front. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. It's not a particularly good corner there. Continues his run. Gabriel Jesus. And nothing comes of this attack. And pressing from the front. Odson Edouard. Has a go! Well, credit to him for trying it. Didn't miss by much. Well, we're into the final half hour. And putting pay to the danger. Well, there's an example of how to press high up. And Palace moving the ball with purpose. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Gabriel Martinelli. White. Havertz. And the decision is one of offside here.
Will Hughes. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. He's in behind. And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Played over. Not the best clearance. Martinelli. Well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Kai Havertz. Could be! Oh, missed the chance! Glorious opportunity to level it. Well, what a chance for the equaliser. They really should have scored there. Take it away. He won the ball. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point. And momentum is with them. Well, let's take another look. And it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Well, they still have designs on the win. Looking for someone to play it to. And they remain locked together, these two sides, on the back of that save. Well, that keeps it all level. What an important save that is. And in a crowded area, the keeper has managed to get there. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. A disappointing end to the move. Ezzy. He's protecting it effectively. And Palace could be onto something. Just the challenge that was required. Now what can they do from here? They could pick out a teammate. And with the teams locked together, Arsenal chasing and chasing that winner. Cuts it back. A wild effort it was, and probably the less said about it, the better. Number 17. And time for the change now. To be replaced by number two, Joe Ward. Good looking move. And there the move ends for now. And there's the whistle. They cannot be separated after 90 minutes.